Hello everyone, welcome to Vinod Ratinam Tutorials. Today we are going to learn the use of method annotation. We have two types of method annotation. First one before method and the second one is after method. Please click on subscribe button and don't forget to tap the bell symbol to get notified about new videos. Thank you. This is a book definition. Before method annotation will run before each test method. After method annotation will run after each test method. Let me explain this with an example so that you will get more clarity. Let's consider we have to automate these three scenarios. The first scenario launch the application and then navigate to contact us page and finally close the application. In the second scenario we have to launch the application then navigate to course fee then close the application and the third scenario is launch application then navigate to request demo and finally close application. These are all the scenarios we want to automate. Here we can see the launch application and the close applications are repeatable for each scenario. It's either a three scenario or it's a ten scenario. The launch application and the close application are the common methods. So instead of coding this method again and again, what we can do is we can code it once and use it again and again, which can be done using method annotation. Here navigate to contact us, navigate to course fee and navigate to request demo or test annotation method. Then the launch application and the close application we can use before method and after method the launch application will be executed before each test method and close application will be executed after each test method first let me show the coding part of this without selenium implementation once we complete it i will execute with selenium coding let me create a test ng test case right click on the package then test ng create test ng test case the class name is method annotation same name I am giving for XML also click on finish you know how to create a method for each one let me delete this first we will write the methods then we will implement the annotation public void launch application launch application method is executed public void close application Similarly, I have created the methods for navigate contact as navigate course fee and navigate request demo. Five methods we have created and we know very well these three are test annotation method at test. These three are test annotation method. Now we are going to make this launch application as at before method. When you make it at before method, we will get the warning symbol, then import before method test annotation. All the class files which is related to before method is imported. Similarly, at after method, import all the after method class file. As per the requirement, what we have done is we made launch application as before method, close application as after method. Now these three method will be executed, but I want to execute in a sequence. So I am implementing the priority, priority equal to one. This will be executed first, priority equal to two, priority equal to three. Now we will execute and see how this particular code will work. Run as test ng test. The execution is completed. You can see first the launch application method is executed. After that, navigate contact as is executed. Then close application method is executed. Similarly, launch application executed, then navigate course fee executed. After that, close application executed. Same way for the navigate request demo page also executed hope you understood the importance of method annotation as i already said the same example i will show with the selenium code for uh, more clarity i'm not going to show the coding part of selenium i have directly coded it i'm just going to show only the execution part 
I made the web driver as a comment for all the method that's why public static web driver and driver object before method is launch application we have set the system property then created a new object for chrome driver maximizing the browser then navigating to vinodtarasguidance.com once launch application is done this will be navigating to contact us page then close application will be executed same way it will execute for rest of the two methods let me run and show the real time scenario run as test ng execution started url is launched then it is navigating to contact us page application is closed once again the browser is launched now it should navigate to course fee it is navigating to the course fee after this browser is closed and uh, for the third scenario browser is launched it should navigate to the request demo page it's navigated successfully then browser is closed this is the console report you can see all the three scenarios executed this is how we have to implement in our real time project and uh, we didn't code launch and the close application multiple time just we have used at before method at after method that's the big advantage of using the annotation hope you got an idea about method annotation same way we have various annotation which we will be seeing in the upcoming session that's the end of today's session in case of any clarification please post your comments or mail me thanks for watching happy learning